Um, I think um, their sort of defense today was really collapsing in on Ruthie, and they were all so focused on Sabrina coming off on balls, and she did a great job to find both me and Erin, and I think our team did a really good job to find the hot hands, I guess. Yeah, I think we knew going into the game as part of our game plan that um, – a lot of the attention was going to be focused on Ruthie rolling off of the ball screens. And so a, a big part of it is we have shooters coming in, um, looking for that shot and confident and ready. Um, we knew it was coming, so we were prepared. And um, I think that helps all of us um, get into a good rhythm. I think we're more consistent defensively. I, last time we played ASU, we played a really consistent three quarters and we kept them to really low, low scoring. But I think in the fourth quarter, they ended up scoring 30 points. So we just really limited their, their offense. Like they're a really good offensive team and we did really well consistently to stop them. Yeah, I think so. It was really gritty, to um, you could say. Like, um, we had to play really tough, and so it's a good feeling to be able to keep a lead that big when um, there's a lot of fouling and um, it's a very like physical game. Yeah. Is that what you come to expect when you see Arizona State on the schedule? It's been kind of physical and just trying it out. Yeah, I think it, since I've been here, it, they, every team that they've had um, that's been part of the scout is that it's going to be a very physical game. You're just going to have to grind it out. There's going to be a lot of fouls, um, so you just have to play through it. Prepare yourself at all for knowing you might be getting extra bump here or there just because that's how they're, they're going to play? Um, I think mentally it's good um, bef always before you play a physical team like that to get ready, um, uh, knowing you have to finish through contact and um, being ready to find open uh, shooters on the perimeter when they collapse in. Arizona State was the last team that you guys lost. Do you guys wake up with a little more energy coming into this game knowing that they were the last team you lost to with a little more firepower? Yeah, 100%. I think it was definitely a revenge game for us, and we knew that we are the better team, and we knew that we shouldn't have lost that game, so we had a fire in our belly to come out here and just show them what how we can really play and the better team that we are. Yeah, I think... Um, you know, we are prepared for things like that to happen. Um, I, I like to think that, um, you know, we work well enough together on the court that no matter what lineup we have, um, we have, we're lucky to have really um, intelligent guards that um, can make um, the right read no matter what lineup that we have in the game. Um, I think uh, we were able to be uh, pretty successful, especially on the defensive end when we had the smaller lineup in. Um, so, um, we did a good job with the guards, especially trying being physical with them on the defensive end. There's a lot of chatter out there. I know both of you guys can talk about There's a lot of chatter between them and you guys. It appeared that way. Was there, was there a lot of emphasis on their part to, to really hit you guys and, and be physical with you? And, and what was the talk about? Um, I think it was just a high emotional game. Um, we did really well to stay united and not let our emotions get the better of us and our team came together and I think we played better with that. I think that they were all fired up and just really wanted to come out and hit us and stuff like that, but we did really good to stay together and not let that affect us. Yeah, I mean, I agree. I think we stayed together really well and that's part of the reason why we were able to keep um, that lead in the second half especially. Um, we just did a really good job of um, staying united and it, we were you know there was some talking back and forth but I think that's part of the the game and we knew that coming in um it comes with the physicality yeah me and Taylor I like playing with Taylor at the top I think we read each other really well and she's always if I'm at the top of the, the um, zone she's always talking to me behind me and it's really good so we interchange really well and get nice steals so it's a lot of fun playing with her Thanks, you guys.